Hey, it is Brigzar, and we're looking at a LEGO City set. This is a special edition set from 2008. It is set 7733, truck and forklift. Had 343 pieces. That's the box that went to the set there. As you see there, it says special edition. And then the back of the box shows the features and how to build it, but, or how to unpack it. Whatever, you don't need really to know that. But anyway, it's a, a neat little truck. I really liked the way it look, looked when I saw it. I wanted to get it. Did not buy this when it was new in store, so I bought it from a reseller on eBay. So I had to fix the missing and incorrect pieces on it. Uh, you may find some that I didn't build right, and there are still some problems with it. You've probably already noticed one major problem, which is actually... Um, something that happens quite a bit. So, and I am missing one sticker at least. But good enough. Got the truck. The main thing I wanted was the truck anyway. And it's got some cargo. Two minifigures. And let's look at it. Here are the two minifigures. Nothing spectacular. You got one guy with his shades on. Crooked hair. <laughs> Sorry about that. And you got another guy that's got a smirk and a scruffy beard going on there. So nothing spectacular, pretty generic uh, going on with the minifigures. Whoops. Here's your cargo. We've got three different types of cargo. This kind of looks like an octane type thing going on there. I don't know what radioactive chemicals we got there. And then these that say cargo, breakables. It's almost like mail or something. Little stickers going all the way around that box. Actually like these. I like the cargo. Good cargo. And now we'll pull out the forklift which I had some problems with this is it looked good like I said on the box but it's just not a really good build and we'll get to the truck in a minute and th this I know it's ages 5 to 12 but I imagine a 5 year old would have a hard time with this set I had a lot of problems with it uh, this part here where the forklift connects to these antenna type pieces that are used to make the you know the cage part is just not well built and then now this has nothing to do with the quality of the set whoever owned it before me they stretched the spring too far so they ruined it so I just we connected it kind of a funny way to keep it from falling off so I need to replace that spring and this actually happens a lot in these old sets if kids played rough too rough one because really this the forklift should sit up like that with the spring and then you gotta push it down in fact, usually when I have a forklift set, I like to put the cargo on there and do the spring test where you push it down and it'll throw the cargo up in the air. But can't do it with this one. And so it's got dually wheels here in the front, single wheel in the back, and I'm missing a sticker. Should have another chevron over here. But this bit part of the build is kind of aggravating, and I didn't like it. And it was kind of hard. Either that or I just can't build good, which could be a combination of that. But I, I, I think... a young kid would have a hard time connecting this level so that's what I think about the forklift now we'll get over to the truck and if my forklift worked right I could load the cargo in to the truck like that and then the doors close so we'll just close go ahead and close the doors and move the extra cargo out of the way I like that it's a dual truck with, you know you got the regular truck and then the trailer behind it's kind of small and it's not exactly like uh, trucks that I see. This, I think, is more of a European style truck. It's got the cargo stickers over it. And so it's a real simple build as far as the trailers are. And they're, they're sturdy. But the problem I had was connecting this part of the trailer to the truck. It's just, it just does not connect real well. And if I take it apart, see there, the headlight comes off. Or not the headlight, the uh, tail light comes off. And it just doesn't want to connect real well. And usually when I push it down, the, the wheels come separated from the cab, just like it just did. Sometimes the front would fall off. It just is a pain. It was a real pain. But this you can separate the trailer. It's got a sticker back there. And again, I'm not the original owner. I try to do a better job of putting my stickers than that. But uh, that's the round view of the rear trailer and then this one is same it's got the chevron there stickers all around gas tank sticker there and then the tag in the front 
and the minifigure can fit inside. This set came with the coffee cup as well. I think one of the guys is holding, yeah, he's holding the coffee cup. And then you just, uh, uh, I hate that. But that's the way that looks. So, yeah, it's just, it's not a very sturdy build. So there you have it, set 7733 truck and forklift. It is from 2008. It is kind of hard to find. I don't know how limited or special edition it was, but it is hard finding them for sale in the reseller market. Uh, but they're not completely rare where you, you'll never find one if you're looking for it. But as far as some of the Lego trucks I've built, uh, this is this one was a, a little disappointing for me. Uh, just... I did like the look of it when I saw it in on the box and pictures of it on Bricklink and stuff, but it just after I built it, I not not real happy with it as far as the the construction of it. Do like the look of it, just not happy with the construction of it. Tell me what you think. Is that an accurate depiction? I mean, be honest. If I was filming while I was building it, and I was real careful not to break it while I was doing my video, but the thing kept falling apart. It was almost as bad as the orange garbage truck. I don't know if you saw my video with the orange garbage truck. That thing is actually, that one and this one are about, they're close. I think the orange garbage truck is a worse build, but this one is pretty close. I wonder, I wonder if they were designed by the same person. It's interesting. This, what did this say on the, this says KS. I have to go back and look at that orange garbage truck. I wonder if it's KS. Anyway, thanks for watching this video. Leave your comments below. Tell me if I was too hard on this set. Or tell me if I didn't tell you enough about this set. I don't know. Just keep watching. This Briggs are.